This is an article that came out in Forbes magazine, November 20th, 2017. Earth's rotation is mysteriously slowing down. Experts predict uptick in 2018 earthquakes. So they're predicting, ladies and gentlemen, that the earthquakes are going to become much stronger in 2018. Scientists have found strong evidence that 2018 will see a big uptick in the number of large earthquakes globally. Earth's rotation, as with many things, is cyclical, slowing down by a few milliseconds per day, then speeding up again. You and I will never notice this very slight variation in rotational speed of Earth. However, we will certainly notice the result, an increase in the number of severe earthquakes. Geophysicists uh, are able to measure the rotational speed of Earth's extremely precisely calculating slight variations on the order of milliseconds. Now scientists believe a slowdown of the Earth's rotation is the link to be observed. Cyclical increase in earthquakes. To start the research team of geologists analyze every earthquake to occur since 1900 at a magnitude above 7.0. They are looking for trends in the occurrence of large earthquakes. What they found is roughly every 32 years, there was an uptick in the number of significant earthquakes worldwide. And we certainly have seen some big ones even around in North America. I mean, if you remember, Mexico had uh, for a couple of pretty deadly earthquakes not that long ago, just a few months ago. The team was puzzled as to the root cause. Okay, so they're puzzled about, you know, the slowing down of Earth, you know, and how it correlates with the strong uptick of earthquakes. But you know what? I look at it like this. We are at the end of the 6,000 years. Earth is going to do whatever it has to do to cleanse itself. Okay. Um, specifically, the team noted that around every 25 to 30 years, Earth's rotation began to slow down. And that slowdown happened just before the uptick of earthquakes. The slowing down rotation historically has left has lasted for five years, with the last year triggering an increase in earthquakes. To add an interesting twist to the story, 2017 was the fourth consecutive year that Earth's rotation had slowed. This is why the research team believe we can expect more earthquakes in 2018. It is the last of the five-year slowdown in Earth's rotation. <coughs> okay. With, as with many new findings in science, this story began with the data that supports a cyclical slowdown, then speed up of Earth's rotation. The research team is then taxed with why to explain this phenomena. While scientists aren't exactly sure the mechanisms that produce this variation, there are a few hypotheses. One hypothesis involves Earth's outer core, a liquid metal layer of the planets that circulates underneath the solid lower mantle. The thought is that the outer core can at times stick to the mantle, 
causing a disruption in its flow. This would alter Earth's magnetic field and produce a temporary hiccup in Earth's rotation. Currently, the data only notes a striking correlation, but no causation. Hence, scientists are still unsure whether this change in Earth's rotation is the cause of an uptick in earthquakes. While there's no direct link between the two, the trend over the past century suggests that 2018 will be an unusually active year for earthquakes. Typically, there will be 15 to 20 large quakes, and they're talking about 7.0 or stronger. However, during the noted uptick in earthquakes aligned to, uh, to the fifth year of Earth's rotation slowdown, there are on average 25 to 30 large earthquakes. Earthquakes remain the most difficult natural disaster to predict. They tend to occur with little to no forewarning and can thus be incredibly destructive. And you see the condition of Iran. Iran got hit with a pretty massive one um, probably like a week ago and just the damage. I mean, it just completely destroyed roads and buildings. It really looks a mess over there in Iran right now. Oftentimes, geologists are limited to historical trends in data to predict the likelihood an earthquake will occur. This new research provides another data set to inform communities about the near-term risk they face. All right. So this is the final year that the earth is rotating slower. So, and, and what they're pretty much saying is the fifth year of this trend is usually when we get hit with the strongest earthquakes. So if nothing else is an interesting piece. Please leave your comment and subscribe, and don't forget to hit on that notification bell. Peace, family.